Craving to have homemade satay stick? In this video, we're going to show you how you can make delicious chicken kebab in the comfort of your home. So let's get right to it. The ingredients are plain yogurt, chili powder, cumin powder, cinnamon powder, chicken leg, garlic, lime, salt and black pepper. Here we go and let's get started. Toki Omi Cook has many pre-recorded recipes inside this smart cook machine. Once we have selected our desired recipe, in this case, that will be what we are doing today, the chicken kebab. Firstly, let's prepare the seasoning sauce. We add 2 teaspoons of chili powder, followed by 2 teaspoons of cumin powder. Next, half teaspoon of cinnamon powder. And lastly, half teaspoons of chili flakes. Once all these are ready, we can add in the 150g of plain yogurt into the mixing bowl first. Then follow by the sizzling powder that we have prepared earlier into the mixing bowl. Next, add about 15g of garlic. Cut out a lime and extract the lime juice. A pro tip for you, you may use a fork to prevent the seeds from falling into the mixing bowl. Just like this. Next, a quarter teaspoon of salt. Meanwhile, we can ground the black pepper seeds into powder. Otherwise, you can just get the ready-made black pepper powder type. Then add quarter black pepper powder. Cover the lid and you are ready to make the seasoning sauce just by the click of a button. While the smart machine doing the heavy lifting job for us, we can now prepare the chicken legs by sliding them into little cubes, just like this. Now let's take a look at how our seasoning sauce looks like. Mmm, looking good. Next, we can pour the seasoning sauce into the chopped chicken's legs and marinate it. Another pro tip, you may use a fork and poke the chicken leg so that the sauce can seep into the meat for better seasoning. We recommend letting the chicken leg stay marinated for about 30 minutes. After which, we can start to lay them nicely into the microwave tray as getting them ready to be grilled. If you are just like us, unable to get home of any wooden sticks, probably this is the best way to get them grilled. Before this, we have already preheated our oven to 180 degrees. So now it is ready for us to send the marinated meats to be grilled. Then set the timer to be 20 minutes or if you prefer to let it grill until golden. 20 minutes later. Yay, it is ready and let's see our final product. Mmm, looking good and smell great too. But wait, something is not very right. How come our final products look so much different? Come, let's fast rewind to where we first saw how the chicken kebab should look like. Aha, uh -huh, yes, you caught us. This is our first imagination of how a chicken kebab should look like. Then this is what we saw how a chicken kebab should look like when using Toki Omi Cook recipe. Well, still looks quite comparable. But the actual fact is, this is how our final chicken kebabs looks like. With no cosmetic stitch dressing, like a wooden stick, beautiful plate and environment settings. Let's get real, this is how a homemade chicken kebab me looks like. But most importantly, how does it taste? If you have missed our earlier video on our freshly made mushroom soup, click on this video now. 